Hi, welcome back to my other brand new video, Wi-Fi connected but no internet on your Android phone. Sometimes it might be facing this issue because your router is not connected to the internet. So try to connect to the router wirelessly using another device and see if you can access internet. And today I am sharing with the 7 simple easy steps to solve this problem. If you ever been into a situation where your phone is connected to the Wi-Fi but still no internet, then you don't have any that is. If you are facing this situation right now, then there are dozens of reasons for that to happen. Will you consider yourself lucky because we have set of simple steps that lets you diagnose this problem by yourself. So first, check if uh, mobile data is turned off. While you have mobile data turned on and connected to the Wi-Fi network, and you are not able to access the internet, so try disabling a uh, mobile data to fix the issues. Android might not see it as an active connection and uh, because of your mobile data. So step number one, disable and enable Wi-Fi on your Android phone. So if your phone is not connecting to the internet, even if the phone is connected to the Wi-Fi router. So go to the settings and turn the Wi-Fi toggle off, add on again and see if the problem is solved. So step number two, forget the network. If the above method didn't work, for then this solution may work for your problem. This solution is just an upgraded version of the previous solution, but it works sometime. All you have to do is forget the Wi-Fi network you are connecting to the internet and then connect back it again. And these methods needs you to forget the network and connecting back to it using this password. For that, go to Settings, Network and Internet and Wi-Fi, tap the network you are connected to and tap the Forget button. Once done, connect back to the network using this password. Step number 3. Check the router. If your router may be the problem and you can fix it using these few simple tricks. Restarting the router also works in this scenario and so you can just try that before anything else. If that didn't work, then see if the router is blocking the network traffic in the router's dashboard. So to check if the traffic control feature is on, go to browser and navigate to the router's dashboard. Go to advanced tab and select traffic control from there. Disable the traffic control features from there and see if the network works on your phone or not. So, step number 4 is reset network settings on Android. If you are still facing the internet connectivity issue on your Android phone, then you can try resetting the network setting on your smartphone. This simple and it won't delete any of your saved data on your smartphone. So, step number 5, check time and date settings. Another thing that looks common but configured time and date settings can cause a lot of problems. Generally, Android devices are configured to obtain time and date information automatically and from your network operators. However, if you have changed those settings, then reset the settings again. Because when the settings set to manual, the clock may not be updated due to a restart. So, step number 6. Change wireless mode on router. It happens only if you have an old Wi-Fi card or device. If you are getting internet access on other device, then chances are there is a communication barrier between your Android and router. There are different wireless modes on a router. For instance, you might have seen something like 802.11b or 802.11bg or 802.11bgn. This BGN and LC are different wireless standards. To fix this issue, log into your router dashboard and log for the options that says wireless mode. Note and it's under the wireless settings where you set Wi-Fi SSID and password. Next you will see a drop down menu, click on that and choose 802.11b and save changes. Now restart the Wi-Fi and check if fixed 
the problem you can change the channel setting as well you can fix the channel you want to now step number seven set up a static ip on your phone if the problem is not fixed yet after doing this please follow this step go to settings and network and internet then wi-fi tap the network and you are connected to and tap the name and you will see the static ip list click and choose a ip for you you can change the ip address dns subnet as well but only change the ip and save it then go back to your wi-fi you can see it's connected it will help very easily for this method your internet will not vanish again hopefully it will help you to find your wi-fi problem thanks for watching my video if you like at my video please subscribe my channel and click the bell icon for notification i'll see you in next video thank you